Rise and shine. Like any good farmer, before harvesting mutant crops, you gotta check your equipment. Let's get started. You should have one rule book, 11 farmer meeples, and to feed and sow those mutant crops, you're gonna need 24 of each kind of token. You're also gonna have one action card that's double-sided depending on the number of players you got. You'll also have six stage one cards, as well as three stage two cards and three stage three cards. Let's not forget about those mutant crops. You should have 19 crop cards. Now that you got everything checked off your list, time to put it all together. Start by shuffling all 19 of those crop cards together. Then take your six stage one cards and place them in two rows of three. Then shuffle your stage two cards, followed by your stage three cards. Take your stage two cards and place them face down beside your stage one cards. Then take your stage three cards and place them face down underneath your stage two cards. Then take your shoveled crop deck and place it face down above your stage cards, revealing three or four crop cards depending on the number of players. Place the action card beneath the stage cards with the black farmer meeple on it. Make sure each player's got two or three farmer meeples depending on the number of players. And lastly, Group those water, meat, and seed tokens together into three separate piles and place them underneath the stage cards. Now, you're ready to start harvesting some mutant crops.